Let's break that down a little bit. We're going to bend the first fret. Don't think it has an actual uh, destination. It's not a half step or whole step bend, just kind of a just kind of just getting going. An intro bend per se. So we have this. So I'm hitting the first fret, and then on the sixth string, hammer on to the third fret. And I pick it again to do that once, twice. And that last time I just did the hammer on, I don't do the actual pick at the end. So, so it's pick, hammer on, pick again. Pick, hammer on, pick again, and then just a hammer on. Okay, and then we're going to slide up to the seventh fret on the sixth string. Okay, and then we'll play the fifth fret on the fifth string, and then seventh fret on the fifth string, back to the fifth fret on the fifth string. So we have this. So that part. The next part, we're going to do a hammer on from the second fret to the third fret on the fifth string. Kind of the same uh, little pattern, so it's pick, hammer on, pick, pick, hammer on, pick, pick, hammer on. And then we have this. So we'll slide from the third fret to the seventh fret on the fifth string. And then five on the fourth string, seven on the fourth string, oh sorry, eight on the fourth string, and then back to five on the fourth string. So, so three, seven, five, eight, eight on the fourth string, and then five on the fourth string. So that tail end. Whole step bend to the ninth sound of the ninth fret on the fourth string. Come back down to the seventh fret, let it return. Go to the fifth fret on the fourth string. Let's go back to that seventh fret, slide to the ninth fret. Okay, and we'll play seventh fret on the third string. And then we'll play the ninth fret on the third string and do a pull off. So, and then we'll have a just bend the ninth fret to the eleventh fret, come back down, which is the sound of the eleventh fret at least, come back down to the seven, so nine, whole step, back down to that nine, seven, pinky grabs the tenth fret on the first string. Then we're going to do a whole step bend on the 10th fret on the 2nd string. Kind of kill it in the air. And then 8th fret on the 2nd string. Let's put all that together. So for this part, we're going to hold the 6th fret on the 2nd string. Then we're going to pre-bend the fifth fret to the sound of the seventh fret. So let's hear that sound, seven to five. Whole step pre-bend here, seven to five. So that's how you want to sound. And we'll come back to here. A lot of tension at the end of the neck, so it's a bit challenging. You might want to use your first and second finger to do this bend. But we're going to do a whole bend from the second fret to the fourth fret on the third string. You hit those two parts together. There you go. 
So I'm going to hold, and, and I'm holding down the third fret on the second string. So. So, basic uh, rule of thumb is that any uh, time I want to get that kind of um, snap, I'm using my first finger. So I go back and forth, and I'll use my first finger to get that a lot, and then my thumb pick is there to add some support as well. So we get this. So that's a pluck. Especially that intro. So we do a pluck, hammer on, and pick. So. third finger to grab that snap that and then, so that was my you know I didn't plug it very hard on that part so that's the basic rule of thumb for everything um, in this song for sure.